I hope she recovers quickly and I admire her even more for being so brave and sharing something so intimate and so personal with the world with the objective of inspiring women to heal that are victims of, of cancer as well. I haven't read it, I have to be honest, although I've certainly heard about it today in a lot of uh, different ways, and I know I will. Um, I mean, I think she's, she's just made of class, you know, and, uh, and I think it's uh, really remarkable that she's able to use her exposure to initiate the kinds of dialogues that really help advance our society, and that's all that really people in that position can be asked of, I think. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I, I feel odd even commenting because I don't know the woman at all. But I think, um, I think it, it's for a woman to, to make that choice is incredibly courageous. It must have been such an emotional um, journey for her to make that choice. And I can only imagine that she made it out of uh, a, a desire to be healthy. And um, I, you know, I hope her family's okay. I hope she's doing well. And, and yeah. Uh, I, I, when I first heard uh, the, uh, the, um, the story, I felt so much compassion and love for Angelina and her family, and um, I feel that, that she is so brave and courageous for doing what she's doing, and she sets an amazing example uh, for, uh, for, for women in general, and, you know, she is, she's an icon.